Two teenage boys have been arrested in connection with the overdose death of that 15 year old girl at Bernstein High School. Police say there will be more arrests further up the drug selling food chain. Today, the girl's family spoke out. Eyewitness News reporter Rob Hayes is live in downtown LA where police announced the arrest. Rob? Yeah, at the root of this case is fentanyl. Investigators say the kids who overdosed thought they were buying Percocet pills, but they ended up being laced most likely with fentanyl. And now a 15 year old girl is dead and another 15 year old is facing manslaughter charges. Friends and family of Melanie Ramos drop off candles and flowers on the steps of Bernstein High School. Police say Melanie and a friend overdosed on fentanyl laced drugs that they bought on campus Tuesday. They both passed out in a restroom here. The other girl came to around 9 p.m. Melanie died. A parent never wants to live this nightmare. The girl's aunt talking to the media today. Melanie's mother also spoke, but only in Spanish. The family's asking why the two girls weren't found earlier. Our question is why so late? Why late? Like, does, is there not a routine where the school checks that there's no student left behind? This afternoon, Los Angeles city leaders held a news conference outside LAPD headquarters to announce the arrests of two boys, a 15 year old who's accused of selling the possibly fentanyl laced drug that killed Melanie and a 16 year old who they say sold drugs that landed two other high school students in the hospital that same night. Our work does not stop because these two individuals, 15 and 16 years of age, are simply transferring and soldiering, if you will, this, this distribution. There is a or drug organization behind this. We will identify who are supplying these drugs to these two individuals. Our cameras were there this morning when LAPD detectives served a search warrant at a Hollywood apartment, home they say to one of the suspects in the case. Mayor Eric Garcetti today warning drug pushers that the full force of the law is coming for them. These are not overdoses. These are people who have been poisoned. Uh, these are murders. If you prey on our children, it will not end well for you. Now, Chief Moore today says his investigators have been dealing with a string of fentanyl based um, overdoses in the city since August 26. He and the mayor are asking parents to talk to their kids now, warn them about fentanyl, that it's being mixed into all kinds of different drugs and can prove to be deadly. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.